With the first pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Minnesota Timberwolves select Anthony Edwards from the University of Georgia. So Anthony Edwards with his mother and grandmother with him there in spirit. He knows which hat he can take out of that big box now, and it is the one that belongs to the Minnesota Timberwolves. Anthony, with those two women that are behind you literally and figuratively in mind, with their legacies in mind, you've said that being the number one pick would be exceptionally cool. Here we are. How does it feel? I mean, it's an indescribable feeling. I mean, I can't even describe it. Uh, my family is emotional. I feel like when I get off here, I'm going to get emotional, and I'm just blessed to be on measures to be in this situation. Mm. And you said that your mother and grandmother have built you to be who you are, and you wouldn't be who you are today without them. How are you honoring their legacy today? Um, as you can see, uh, my grandmother's, my grandmother's right here, and my mother is right here. And the shirt that, uh, with the collaboration I had, I got my grandmother's name and my mother's name in my shirt, so. They're with me at all times. Absolutely. This is a really special day for your family. We are wishing you all the best. Congratulations. I know this looks different, but happy number one pick. Reese, back to you. With the second pick in the 2020 NBA draft, the Golden State Warriors select James Weissman from the University of Memphis. James Weissman at his home in Nashville, Tennessee, played just a few games for Memphis this past season, but he goes second overall to Golden State. A big, versatile guy. He has his virtual moment with the commissioner. With the third pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Charlotte Hornets select LaMelo Ball from Chino Hills, California. <laughs> A LaMelo Ball goes third overall to Charlotte. Hey, look, this is LaMelo's night, but Lonzo still has bragging rights because he went second overall in 2017. <laughs> and if you know the competitive spirit of the Ball brothers, I would say that after Lonzo gives him his time in the sun, probably won't let him forget that. With the fourth pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Chicago Bulls select Patrick Williams from Florida State University. There is Patrick Williams, and he's going to Chicago to play for Billy Donovan, played for Leonard Hamilton at Florida State. With the fifth pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Cleveland Cavaliers select Isaac Okoro from Auburn University. Isaac Okoro celebrating, going fifth overall. Right up close to the top of the draft, like some former Auburn stars like Charles Barkley, Chuck Person, Chris Morris. has been a, a great number of stars who have come out of Auburn over the years. With the sixth pick in the 2020 NBA draft, the Atlanta Hawks select Onyeka Okongwu from the University of Southern California. And here he is, Onyeka Okongwu going in the first round, sixth overall, two-time Mr. Basketball player in the state of California. Only the fourth guy to do that. Jason Kidd, Aaron Gordon, Tyson Chandler, all also drafted. With the seventh pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Detroit Pistons select Killian Hayes from Lakeland, Florida. Yeah! Killian Hayes. With his folks, his dad played for three years at Penn State. And Killian getting his moment, and he is headed to the Detroit Pistons as Wayne Casey and company try to find some guys to build a franchise around. With the eighth pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the New York Knicks select Obi Toppin from Dayton University. What an emotional moment for the Dayton Flyer. Getting a round of applause from Adam Silver. It wasn't really that long ago that this would seem to be an unthinkable turn in the career of Obi Toppin. B, your mother recently said that if you had told her five years ago that you would be an NBA player. Oh, man. Uh, 
I wouldn't believe her. I swear to God, I wouldn't believe her. Mm. Oh, this is. Well, I'm sorry. Damn, bro. Christine. Christine. I'm sorry. No, you don't need to be sorry. She said that she would have thought it was an April Fool's joke. How do you process this leap that you've made that has catapulted you to be an NBA lottery pick? It's a blessing. I want to thank God. Without him, I would not be here. Without my parents, I wouldn't be here. Without my teammate right here to the left of me, I wouldn't be here. I appreciate you, bro. Jalen Crutcher, shout out to Jalen Crutcher. I wouldn't be out. I wouldn't be here without him. My coach is right here in the back, Coach Grant. Brent, Coach Greer, I would not be here without them. So I'm very grateful, and it's a blessing to be in this position. So, If being drafted wasn't special enough, yep, that's right. Point to that hat one more time. You are coming home. Why is it so important to you to be putting on a Knicks jersey? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Why is it so important to you to be putting on that jersey? I'm from New York. That's why it's important. Me, me, me repping my city is it's amazing. A lot of people pray to be in this position, and, and I'm not going to take it for granted. I promise you that. I pro- Thank you so much. And congratulations. Hopefully we get to see you at Dykeman or one of those parks on the street soon a little bit too. Reese. With the ninth pick in the 2020 NBA draft, the Washington Wizards select Denny Avdia from Herzliya, Israel. So Denny Avdia, a guy that we've talked about a lot in our coverage leading up to the draft, goes in the top ten. Ninth overall to the Washington Wizards, youngest ever to play for Maccabi Tel Aviv at the age of 16. With the 10th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Phoenix Suns select Jalen Smith from the University of Maryland. Jalen Smith. So Jalen Smith out of Maryland. Averaged a big double-double and two and a half blocks per game last year while shooting about 54%. And there is Jalen celebrating there. His parents were going to make sure that they attend his game because dad spent a lot of time away as a kid. With the 11th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the San Antonio Spurs select Devin Vassell from Florida State University. The second Seminole of the night going off the board. Devin Vassell joining Patrick Williams, his teammate at Florida State, as lottery picks, and Vassell is going to the San Antonio Spurs. With the 12th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Sacramento Kings select Tyrese Halliburton from Iowa State University. Tyrese has been waiting for a while, and do you think this is an absolute steal for the Kings, Jay Will? I, I do. I, I think he's one of the best guards there is in the draft. And With the 13th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the New Orleans Pelicans select Kyra Lewis Jr. from the University of Alabama. So the celebration for Kyra Lewis Jr., the Alabama guard who played last year for Nate Oates, who's trying to transform that program. With the 14th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Boston Celtics select Aaron Neesmith from Vanderbilt University. Yeah, the bright color suit, that, that looks like uh, on my monitor here, it looks like he has the Celtic green suit. He averaged 23 points a game, shot better than 50% from the four, 52% from three, and led the nation. With the 15th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Orlando Magic select Cole Anthony from the University of North Carolina. Hey, I recognize one of those guys in the Cole <laughs> Anthony celebration. They're Spike Lee celebrating with Cole, who, after a season at North Carolina, 
is going to the Orlando Magic. You were a big time high school player, one of the best high school players. You had some injuries. What are you eager to showcase in the NBA? <laughs> Let me ask you, I, I struggled a lot this year. Mm. Like, Lauren, this is probably one of the hardest years of my life. I just haven't had a very blessed life thanks to my parents, my family, my friends, just my whole support system. And just, I, I never had surgery before. Just having the surgery was just, when I found out I had surgery, it was just, I, it was, it was heartbreaking. I, I broke down, started crying. Dad, you see, I'm crying now. Shoot. But, uh, <laughs> but it's just, um, I just, I, I struggled. I struggled. I continue to struggle. And I'm still struggling to this day. But I, I'm getting better. And it's just, I, I, I'm healthy now. And I just, I can't wait to just get out there and play. I just, I'm so passionate about the sport, the game. It's, this is, this is, this is the best moment of my life right here. I don't like, there's nothing comparing to this moment right here. You may be birth, but this is the absolute best moment <laughs> of my life. It looks like you have a pretty fun celebration going over there. Make sure to tell your parents what they mean to you at some point tonight. Clearly, they've helped you a whole lot. With the 16th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Portland Trailblazers select Isaiah Stewart from the University of Washington. So Isaiah Stewart... Celebrating his selection, 16th overall. Grew up in Rochester, New York. Went across the country to play for UW. And you see him celebrating and getting that Trailblazers hat. With the 17th pick in the NBA draft, the Minnesota Timberwolves select Alexei Hokushevsky from Novi Sad, Serbia. And from Athens, Greece, we showed you the suit that Alexei had chosen last night. Very James Bond look, very sleek, very Mike Schmitz looking, <laughs> looking suit. Stylish guy, he's the youngest eligible player in the draft at the age of 18. With the 18th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Dallas Mavericks select Josh Green from Sydney, Australia, and the University of Arizona. So Josh Green spent a lot of his childhood in Australia, but moved to the United States to sharpen his basketball skills, and that he did. Turned out to be the number eight overall recruit in the ESPN 100. With the 19th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Brooklyn Nets select Sadiq Bey from Villanova Sadiq University. Bay. And Sadiq Bey was a guy who was really wearing out his former Villanova teammate Eric Paschal about what life in the NBA was like when he got to Villanova. He was constantly asking questions about how to get a lot more time on the floor. With the 20th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Miami Heat select Precious Achua from Port Harcourt, Nigeria, and the University of Memphis. Precious Achua was the player of the year in the American Athletic Conference. He was the only freshman in Division I to average a double-double this past year, nearly 16 points, nearly 11 rebounds per game to go along with a couple of blocks. He really, really helped himself with the way he started playing, the effort and the energy that he showed. With the 21st pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select Tyrese Maxey from the University of Kentucky. Well, jubilation and rightfully so for Tyrese Maxey out of Kentucky. With the 22nd pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Denver Nuggets select Zeke Naji from the University of Arizona. So the second Wildcat of Arizona going in this first round. Josh Green earlier was selected with the 18th pick by Dallas. So Zeke Naji 
the freshman who was Pac-12 freshman of the year, first team all-conference. With the 23rd pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the New York Knicks select Leandro Bomaro from Cordoba, Argentina. Leandro Bomaro is selected, and there was such delight that the camera kind of got knocked around a little bit in the initial celebration as the swingman out of Argentina. With the 24th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Milwaukee Bucks select R.J. Hampton from Little Elm, Texas. So R.J. Hampton, who opted not to play in college and instead go overseas to play, is a first-round pick selected by the Bucks, but on his way to New Orleans, not far from his native Texas. Yeah, and he's a blur in the open court. He's going to be one of the fastest players in the entire NBA from the day he steps foot in this league. And he's six foot six. He's explosive. He's really improved as a perimeter shooter as well. And I think really benefited from his season out in New Zealand. With the 25th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Oklahoma City Thunder select Emmanuel Quickly from the University of Kentucky. So the second Wildcat guard going in the last few picks, in the last five picks to be precise, after Tyrese Maxey went to Philadelphia, Emmanuel quickly. With the 26th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Boston Celtics select Peyton Pritchard from the University of Oregon. Peyton Pritchard. Family dog, not knowing what all the commotion's about, I'm sure, in Westland, Oregon, but um, Fido's going to get a few extra treats now because the Pac-12 Player of the Year has just been selected by the Boston Celtics. With the 27th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Utah Jazz select Yudoku Azubuki from Delta, Nigeria, and the University of Kansas. With the 28th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Los Angeles Lakers select Jaden McDaniels from the University of Washington. Second Husky to be chosen tonight as Jaden McDaniels from his home in Renton, Washington is selected. We told you eventually that's going to wind up in Minnesota. <laughs> With the 29th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Toronto Raptors select Malachi Flynn from San Diego State University. And there he is. Mike's talked about him a couple of times tonight. Malachi Flynn going to Toronto. He was the Mountain West Player of the Year and the Defensive Player of the Year. With the 30th pick in the 2020 NBA Draft, the Boston Celtics select Desmond Bain from, Christian, from Texas Christian University. So Desmond Bain, the first draft pick from TCU since Lee Nailon last